Welcome back. And it's Women's Month. Yeah. Wait, sorry, when is Men's Month? Uh, Never. You continue searching. <laughs> Keep searching. There is actually a Men's Day. There is a Men's Day. We're just, you know. But it's a day, month. You women have a whole month dedicated to you. Mm -hmm. It's um, the 21st. Is that enough? Nope. It's not enough. We need like a quarter. Okay. <laughs> like three I months see, look, back to on back. On this one, on this one, <laughs> I, I am with you because I think it's never really enough to celebrate women. Men have been mm. uh, celebrated all through time. Exactly. And, uh, giving women that uh, a piece of the pie, as it were. Not a piece. We want the whole cake. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was just trying to speak Why English. Why are you trying to give us a slice now? I was trying to give you a slice. The pie is small. But the pie, okay, the we are the ones who I love buy women. The, the flour. I love we women. make the dough. Mm. Exactly. Exactly. And we bake and it. We bake it. Oh. <laughs> Big shout out to you or to all the women doing amazing, so amazing things. Uh, I am in awe of the strength of a woman. And I don't, in my own opinion, I don't regard women as the weaker species. Mm. Thank you, Mike. I just want to give a shout out, first of all, to Omolaya Omoto Shaw. Yeah. Yes. Beautiful women. Uh, it was, um, I saw me a lot about the All Africa Games. I love when they are mixed teams and all of yeah. that. Yeah. Uh, you know. <laughs> Something entered in my mind. Just before I shout out to Omolara on Motor Show, Caitlyn Jenner, you know her, transgender, mm, mm -hmm. right? Or you know him or her. Oh, she, him. She oh, has they, been. Oh. They, oh. <laughs> they has been fighting that transgendered women should mm. not participate in oh, women's yeah, sport. Yeah, yeah. Mm. You understand so that when that. she was a man, mm. it was an Olympic, Olymp uh, 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 Olympian. Olympian. Mm. Yeah. You understand? So she oh. understands what it means that if mm. you are not genetically mm. or if you're not born, uh, if you're not cis. Yeah. Gender is a woman, yeah. uh, you have some sort of advantage. So whichever way, there's a mixed relay in uh, the All-Africa Games, and it was Omolara was the reason Nigeria won that medal. Mm. That she boosted through and yeah. pulled. You know, the guys were slacking, but she showed herself. So you see, even on the same stage, on the same roster, on the same uh, 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 oh, yeah. uh, the track, yeah. Uh, Molara did great, so big shout out to Molara. Mm. Big shout out to Toby Almosan. Yeah, she won, of course. It, w it was she was blitzing through. She mm. won 100 meters uh, hurdles gold. Yes. Toby Almosan always on point. Big shout so, out to her. So if you haven't seen the video of this particular race, I suggest you go and watch it. It felt like one of those motivational videos that you see on social media where they're trying to say, "Don't worry, you can do it. You can do it." <laughs> and everybody is just watching what seems to be an impossible feat. Feat. She, and she came did it. from almost nowhere. And, and did it. And well blazed done. through and, well and got the gold. Well done to you her. Know, well done to her. In the 4x400. Four 4x400, yeah. Four by four, so, yeah, wonderful, um, mixed. It's an amazing time for women all over the world, mm. um, not mm. just in Africa. Mm. Um, in Nigeria as well, it's also an amazing time for women in the banking industry. Yeah. Um, we recently celebrated Adora Umeji. Mm. Umeji. Yeah. She's Umeji. The, she was the newly appointed GMD for um, yeah. Zenith Bank, yeah. Nigeria. Yeah. And it's an amazing fit. We mm. see um, this year alone, there's been a lot of um, appointments for yeah. women in high, even um, there was also Pastor Jerry's wife, mm -hmm. Eno Jerry, yeah. okay. was also appointed the chairman of the Abia, Abia Civil Service Commission oh, wonderful. in yeah. Abia State yesterday. Wonderful. Wonderful. So we see women, you know, taking on, you know, conquering and, and shattering those glass ceilings yeah. across different sectors. Let's not use Even the word trees. No, conquering. Dude, I like it. Conquering. I like it. Conquering because I like it. It's, it's inevitable. I like it. I like it. We're, 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 we're getting there. We're going to clinch it very soon. <laughs> I like it. I like the president. It. Yeah. I like it. Even, I like it. Even yeah, right so. here in TVC, we I like have it. an yeah. incoming, incoming female yeah. CEO. I like it. So and great she's things be are happening. First, actually. Yeah, exactly. Female CEO. You know, just before. We talk about uh, Adora and uh, you know some of the controversy around her. Mm -hmm. uh, I just also want to give shout out to the one of to maybe the most inspiring woman ever that I have known as a Nigerian, uh, the late uh, Professor Dora Akin, mm -hmm. who um, I met her once. And when I look through what she has done and all of that, and I think about people like um, uh, you know Ngozi Okonjo Iweala, yeah. mm -hmm. yeah. and of course Obi Ezekwesili, mm -hmm. some sure. women that have done my wonderful mm -hmm. things. Yeah, don't worry about. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Titi, Titi Lion, you. Son, all of that. Wonderful women. I would say well done. And that is why this particular story about Adora Omeoji, and this is, this is um, I think this was a man who put up that story. Mm. She's a very beautiful lady. And, you know, we just want to, we've spoken about her at different times, but, mm. you know, ascribing women's rise mm. based on uh, objectifying women, mm. sexualizing women, and saying that they rose to a particular 
you know, point. point yeah. Because mm. of you know their female attributes is something that should have been left in the nineties. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Shouldn't have been talking about it. We shouldn't, be talking, it. We shouldn't <laughs> be talking about it. No. Now. No. Especially when we see, uh, and it's it, it's we we need to catch up with the world. Mm. I, I put up something on my status, and that was on. Let me let me just read it. It was a quote from Charles Darwin, and it says very simply that. It is not the strongest of species that survive, mm. not the most intelligent, but the ones most responsive to change. Mm. You have to Very understand true. that. Look, it is a world where everybody, irrespective of their gender, should or are given equal opportunities to rise, exactly. to dominate, to conquer, as women yeah. have put it here, and to rule. Yes. And so for someone to come to say, and it was trending over the past few days about how, oh, uh, she got there because of she looks like a... I don't want to mention what the person yeah, of course. Uh, posted. said, posted. Mm. But see, in all, all the men I know, they have sense around me. We jointly condemn such a silly statement mm. and we say that uh, congratulations to her. And yeah. that should stop. So you I wanted to I actually say that mm. she, in terms of qualifications, she not only has a certificate from Harvard, she also has one from Columbia Business School. You get what I'm saying? So yeah. she's already a dame. She's already a doctor. Yeah. Doctor, yeah. Dame doctor. Like, how do you then jump, hop, skip, and jump backward to make such an assumption just and based then, on look? And I, then why, why some people are pushing is that maybe I think she's unmarried. And then people think women's identities should not be linked to a man. Well, she, mm. she, this woman, she's a mother. Mm. She's, a mother. she's a mother of mm. six children, wow. according to mm. my, mm. you know, mm. findings. Mm -hmm. With eight qualifications and certificates <sighs> all together. Like, and she's still being, she's still a mother. Maybe, well, mm. at some point in her life, she could have been a wife, mm. maybe. Yeah. No, but then no. again, <laughs> like you have said, we are getting past that point of relegating women. <laughs> we are in a new era where women are given, should be given equal opportunities. We have seen women take on a lot, you know, take on many strides, yeah. right? So um, comments like this, <laughs> the audacity uh, of that guy, mm. oh, the audacity oh. on you. <laughs> if you have any sort of qualification or, or certificate, you should go and bring it out. I don't give, I don't know what <laughs> gives you that right. Did you use your male genitals to get them? Uh, Is it fair to say that as well? Exactly. Because I don't get it. It's mm. very wrong. It's very, it's, it's so unfair. That, mm. you know, we, that men would should, should, that. should say that or make mm. such comments. Don't, don't mind that. Don't mind that one. We are. Know, we're speaking for men. I think yeah. we're giving. I think we're giving him too much time. Let's just celebrate women as we've been doing for the past yes. few weeks. Continue to celebrate. Continue to strive. Continue to climb. Continue to thrive. Continue in, to conquer. Yes, indeed. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we'll be right here for it. Right. They're just telling me now that we need three days of all women on the show to celebrate women. <laughs> so we'll see you after this time out. <laughs> we'll be oh back in God. a bit. <laughs>